When CNC3 last caught up with Kevon Cooper, his movement was heavily restricted. Two months on though, and he's much more mobile than before. So much so that he's been declared fit to resume competitive action. In the last few weeks, Cooper has shown physical improvement in training with the Trinidad and Tobago Provisional T20 squad and has been deemed fully fit to pick up his 15,000 US dollar contract with Uthara in Sri Lanka. The trainer from Sri Lanka called and wanted to talk to the doctors down here and they cleared me to say I'm okay. You know, um, they get the MRI results and I'm fit and ready to go. So that was a sign of relief for me. You know, um, so as I said, um, I'm just looking forward to Sri Lanka. You know, um, I enjoy playing T20 cricket and you know, I really miss being on the field. You know, um, hopefully I can go there and um, perform as I accustomed doing. You know, and as we know, um, Samuel Benji and I are on the same team, so I'm looking forward to playing with him. But even though he's eager to resume, Cooper says there are some obvious inhibitions. I think any sportsman who now coming off an injury will um, be a bit cautious, you know, um, and the way they move, you know, um, it still plays in my mind, you know, just coming off an injury and, you know, taking it one step at a time. And um, as I said before, hopefully all goes well for me in Sri Lanka. Nevertheless, the Arima native says that a positive outing in Sri Lanka should put him on track for selection for TNT's pending Champions League appearance in South Africa come this October. Yeah, definitely. I'm um, using this um, to go there and um, play hard, you know, and try and perform to the best of my ability. Um, you know, um, as I said before, my aim is to um, get fit and play for China and to begin Champions League, and hopefully we, um, we can do better than last year. You know, so um, I know the guys training hard. You know, I'm looking forward to um, Champions League in South Africa. Reporting for CNC3 Sports, I am Jassy Merik.